so they've been making weaponized pathogens and they're making all of our diseases. They've been doing this for years. How are we going to catch up? Right? So I started on a process on trying to identify these different ones. I think I'm up to like 108 different weaponized pathogens now that I have identified and they're nasty. That's when God started showing me things and so one day I was just crying out and I'm like, okay, what are we going to do about this? And he gave me a word and he said, SIT. SIT, I'm like, what's that? He's like, satanic information technology. But when God speaks to me, it's like, he can say one word, but then the whole thing's in my head. It's like, where does information come from? And it's like, I just knew, like, okay, this is information. On. Satanic information technology is a form of nanotechnology that's really the software version. So it's literally software for nanotech. And it runs everything. They've been spraying it. They've been putting it in the injections. They've been putting it in the food. They've been putting it in different mosquitoes and things that bite or sting. And this form of technology is just crazy because it actually tells the other technology what to do. So when you look at a weaponized pathogen, it's actually half pathogen, half machine. Especially post-2020. Everything changed in 2020. I mean, what we're seeing now is just crazy. But post-2020, 90% of all the infections I see now when I'm testing people, they're not even normal pathogens. They're weaponized. It seems like the demonic side is not allowed to just give man all the answers. So like they can give him so much and then man has to experiment. So they're using man to experiment on themselves to figure out how do we get this technology to really do what we want, which is ultimately change humans into non-humans. 